like a month and didn't see any results anyway, so. What about cooking with red wine? Uh, seems like, ooh, this could be it. This could be my dime. I'm sure there's things out there. Yeah. I think this might be my dime, guys. Yep. Diamond Roach, 3.13 pounds. Check you out. There we go. The Diamond Roach. That leaves me with four diamonds left on Trosporit. Welcome back to the channel, everyone. My name is Darth Sloan, your official partner to content creator for Expansive Worlds. We're out here today fishing for the roach on Troll Sport or Norway. And we're using a size 8 pearl barley to start with. We may move up to a size 7 at some point here. But the roach, if you want to use bloodworm through here, you will be pastured a little bit by some other fish. The pearl barley eliminates a few. You will still get dice and roach and we've got one coming over right here now if it's a dace it's not going to nibble so that tells me pretty much this is a roach right now and if you get tired of catching a few of these smaller roaches you see there one pound bronze we're at 57.4 degrees if you cast a little bit over here to the left a lot of times down that way, closer to that stream, you'll get a little bit cooler temperatures. Anyway, guys, before we go any further, do me a favor, hit that like, subscribe, notify bell. Really helps the channel. With your help, we could possibly reach that go of 10,000 subscribers by the end of 2024. That is my main goal. We are approaching 5,000, so we're almost halfway there and we've got the rest of the year to get there. Hopefully that can happen. And by you guys telling your friends, get out there, hit that sub button for Darth. I appreciate it. Let me know in the comments too, if there's any other guides out there or videos that you would like for me to make. We have all fish covered on Spain and most of them right here on Trosporet. We're marking them off the list. We have our nibble here. Let's see what we've got. Should be a roach. And again, if it just strikes right off the bat, then it's a dice. Nibbles, it should be a roach. If you're using pearl barley. Here we have a silver roach, 56.3. See the temperature dropped a little bit there. So I want to just make my way down this way just a little bit. Just a little bit. I've noticed right through here, if you want to go warmer, go down that way a little bit. If you want to go cooler, go toward this stream. And Jaxie has confirmed, guys, temperatures do matter. They're not the only thing that matters, but they do matter. Diamonds will only fight at certain temperatures. We are fishing at Magic Pond, guys. I will show my map right here after we haul this guy in. Still get a lot of questions. Where's Magic Pond? Everyone needs to know what Magic Pond is. Now there we have another bronze, 57.3 degrees. Let me cast and I'll show you my map right here. There's a trailhead. You can fast travel right here, summon you a boat, move around. You can get a bunch of other diamonds over here in this stream. I've gotten Pike and Xander here toward the middle. I've gotten diamond rough here. I've seen several common dice over here. So Magic Pond is the place to be, guys, for several different diamonds. There are five different diamond locations that are known according to the official Angler Discord. If you know of another spot, please let us know. Let Wilson or Lenny know over there. And let them add it to the Discord. There is a 1.4, 57.6 degree. The diamond roach that I caught earlier was on a number seven pearl barley, by the way. All right, guys, we are at spot number three, according to the official angler Discord. This is another known diamond location for the roach.
So we have just a point, 1.32. Now you do have to fish here a little earlier in the day. Get much warmer temperatures here at this point in the day. You can also catch diamond rough here as well. I caught one yesterday out here fishing for poach. So that's something I'll do sometimes if I'm not just totally targeting roach. So I'll throw on the blood worm, number nine blood worm, because that will get you gold and diamond rough as well. Guys, here we are on the map. You can see there is a trailhead right here. Right off the big lake here. You can also fish over at the, there's like a little dock area over there. Fish over there. Now there is a gold roach, 58.2. That's a good one. 58.2 degrees, 2.4 pounds. That is a nice roach. We will take it. Let's have a look at the five known locations that you can catch a diamond roach. As you can see here, number two is Magic Pond. That is where we started out at. That is my favorite place, and that is where I caught my diamond. Number five here, there's a fast travel point there, but you have to hoof it on down through here. A little bit off the beaten path. Now, number three is where we are right now, where we just caught that nice gold. Number one here is close to Pike Dock. That's where a lot of people like to catch their diamond pike. Uh, you do have to, I think, maybe jump a waterfall there to get down there to it. And number four right here is a lot of people's favorite place to go and fish for brown trout. Although I've got my diamond brown trout down here. But those are the five known locations. If you know another spot, guys, please let us know. Hit that like, subscribe, notify bell, and let us know in the comments if there is a sixth or maybe even a seventh spot that you can catch a diamond rope that you know about. Please let us know, guys. Let Wilson and Lenny know in the official Angler Discord, and they will update that as, as our known spots. But for me, Magic Pond is where I would go, and a number seven, Pearl Barley. Now, if you want to catch rough, dice, and roach, you can catch them right there along that bank and put on a nine blood worm. Nine blood worm will still allow you to catch gold and diamond rough, but I caught mine on a seven pearl barley. You guys do however you want to do it, but Magic Pond is the place to be. Please do me a favor. Let me know guys if there's any other videos out there that you would like for me to make. I am taking requests as always. I plan to make a guide for every single fish on every map. We've done that for Spain and we're almost done with Trosport here. This is my roach guide. This is what I did. Let me know if you have any tips and tricks. Maybe you prefer another bait or another spot, but appreciate you guys and we will catch you in the next video.